the president's tweet on Elizabeth Warren, uh, who he, uh, you know, she's gone through the, her controversy. She's apologized for saying that she was Native American earlier in her life. Um, president Trump did this tweet. He called her Pocahontas. The last line refers to see on the trail in all caps. A lot of people took that to be a, a, a reference to the Trail of Tears, which is, which is obviously a, a tragedy. But take a look at this. Don Jr. took a screenshot of that tweet and a response to it that says, the Native American genocide continues with another murder by the president. And then Donald Trump Jr. captions, quote, savage. I mean, that is blatant racism. And you can, I guess, you know, you could always explain away maybe Trump didn't mean trail of tears when he said trail. But then the other two, that's just racism against Native Americans. And it... And yet, in this day and age, nobody even says anything yeah, about it. It is racist, but it's also clownish. They're playing with people's emotions for fun. And it's absolutely intentional. They're trying to provoke a reaction and then to make people out to be hysterical who cry foul. They want to keep having this debate over political correctness, mocking their opponents. And we've seen this movie before. And I think it's best for everyone to say, like, yep, you guys are being racist clowns again and keep on trucking. But, but, but for people of color, it's more than that, Jake. I mean, I understand your position and your position, but neither one of you all look like me. And racism, whether it's blackface or whether it's against the Native, Native Americans... It's pretty sexist, it's, it's, too. It's, 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 <laughs> it's, exactly. And, and at their core issue, it's painful. It's hurtful. It reminds us and takes us back to, quote, when you make America great again. When people of color hear that, well, it's never been better. It's not... Uh, awesome for African Americans right now, but if you take me back to when America was great, well, it, it wasn't great for African Americans back then either. And so I think when we talk about it, we cannot let it be normalized, and we've got to hold people accountable. They're talking about impeaching uh, the lieutenant governor over alleged sexual misconduct, right? Mm -hmm. But you have an attorney general and a governor who, who have put in, admit they've been in blackface, and that's because of the environment they were in. We can't let them off the hook because it's some high school prank. We have never let them off the hook because that's the environment they grew up in. This may be the New South, but the Confederacy and everything before the New South is coming home to roost because their environment it told Can them to be that way. Can I just clarify that I did actually say he should should resign? Governor, yeah, Governor Northam. Yeah. yeah. I didn't hear that, but okay. if you did, yeah, okay. I, that was at the end of I said I don't yeah. know why Corey doesn't okay. want to get involved right, in enough. this. So, yeah, yeah. And I, I, I can, if there's time, I also want to say on these attacks on Warren, there's been this real focus on poor Elizabeth Warren that she keeps getting attacked. And I think you are rightly focusing on what's important, which is actually, it's very traumatizing for the for the indigenous it's people. Horrific. I mean, mm -hmm. that are having to live through this, right. um, you know, now, and now are really concerned, frankly, that this is gonna be the next year of their life. Well, mm -hmm. it, it, during the Northam Herring incident, it made me concerned that African-Americans think that like, all of us, white men, used to dress up in blackface. Mm -hmm. and, and it's not true. And when this Native American stuff happened, it makes me worried that people in the Native American community think that the rest of us think that the Native American genocide is funny. None of us do. Right, right. It's None of us would make those jokes. But I worry more about the impact the president and his sons have on people, uh, who, on white Americans who take that, take their lead on it, and how mm. they act on it, how they verbalize it.